Yeah, I'm turning my graphics to low. Like, my game cannot handle it. Your game can't handle Baldur's Gate? I don't know. Ah, uh, that hard. What are you doing? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> oh, you're gonna look over the city. Oh yeah. The campsite, the city waits in uneasy silence one sleep away why am i not up there you are you were right there no i saw mentor i didn't see myself oh i saw you the stream saw you chase okay Oh. Let me turn my graph to low projector. I don't know. They left me up you here. Wish to consult me? There you are. Bruh. I'm just trying to walk down and it keeps taking me to all your cutscenes. Uh oh. <laughs> Did you want something? If not, I'm perfectly happy to just gaze upon. Of course. Mm. Fine. What's on your mind? No notes, considering all we've been through. Mm -hmm. I think I was very lucky to find such favorable. Okay. Nothing. Yeah. Dang, they all the way over there. Gale. Gale has something to say? All right, bro. What do you want? I'm coming. The absolute should be a thing of the past, and I with it. Yet, at the risk of angering Mr. Fervor, I'm glad it didn't come to that, given what has come to light. Hardly. I'm more than glad to leave that place behind. The Elder Brain. But, more importantly, the crown that it wore. Even without seeing it for myself, I could sense it. Netherese magic. So pure, so complete. I doubted what I was feeling at first. Most Netherese artifacts contain only the faintest amount of their former power. The ghost of an echo of a memory. That crown was different. I can't fathom how such a wonder survived. Surely everything of its ilk was destroyed along with Netheril itself, but no matter, it exists. I must learn more of it. We need to learn more about what we saw. An artifact as powerful as that crown must have been documented somewhere. As luck would have it, we'll soon find ourselves near one of the finest book collections this side of Candlekeep, Sorceress Sundries. I need to go there and learn all I can. Hmm. 
No, Gail. <laughs> no, Gail. Now, I, I told you about doing that. Indeed. The journey awaits. One foot in front of the other is tried and true, I find. Their collection of rare tomes is unparalleled. Leathery <laughs> sex are hardly commonplace, but I'm Why certain they'll have one or two stashed away. Why are you You'll talking have to like that? My eagerness, but if my suspicions prove to hold water, this could be the answer to all our problems. All right, all right, Gim. All right, let, let, let's go to bed. I'm ready to get the boulder. Where are the beds? They're over here. They're in, over here. Oh, I don't have to play though. Oh my god. She doesn't even have a, an exclamation point over her head, Jess. You're right. Well, so you never know. How can I assist? Dang, you, I don't know. Tell her to give you a kiss. Nah. Press four. <laughs> nah. Big old wet kiss, Jess. No. The events of the last days weigh heavily upon you. Sleep's rest is slow to come to one whose mind is so full. The Absolute is not a god, but an elder brain controlled by the Chosen of the Dead Three. They mean to use it to take control of the Sword Coast. All who carry the Tadpole are governed by the brain and by extension the Chosen. It will take but one order to transform them into an army of mind flayers. This would have been your fate too, were it not for the astral prison and the mysterious visitor inside of it. With her help, you have uncovered the cult for what it really is. A plan of conquest orchestrated by the gods of death themselves. Together, you have the power to thwart the dead three. If you follow this path to its end, the Elder Brain will not answer to the Chosen. It will answer to you. Will you liberate them from their parasites and their religious delusions? Or will you use the power you gain for your own purposes? Imagine if you just turned evil by the end of the game again, Jarvis. to wait all you need to do now is sleep but sleep is not for you you good <laughs> <laughs> we just wake up oh What in the world? We are under attack. Help me. Die, you off. I'm just Yankees. Dang. Fight your way to the portal. <laughs> Damn, I'm sorry. I need I your help. <laughs> Damn, wait, we have to get to the portal. Save, save, save. We have to get to the portal. Yeah. <laughs> I imagine we wake up and we just need to weaken. <laughs> Escape the portal before the absolute takes control. Can we do that? Hope so. Hopefully, only one of us has to, right? Yeah, for sure. You should have just engaged. I'll be getting to it. Come quickly. I can't do this without you. Yeah, just run over there, Jess. I'll walk it off, G. <laughs> Why well, I say like Phoenix from Valley? Walk it off, G. Walk it off. I ain't nothing. All right, you should be able to make it there. I'm hoping not all of us has to, right? 
I, mean, I could kill this guy and then continue to keep running, I guess. Actually, I don't know. Sure, I don't know to kill him. I'll just kill him for that like Uh-oh. Don't push me. We will all become thralls. Breathe deep and move. Go to, yeah. That works. Can you run? Not anymore. So what's the whole rest of the camp doing? They're just like, well, let's just hope they make it. Thank you. <laughs> okay. More are coming. Hurry, or we will all become thralls. I'm right there. It's fine. Can I push you through it? <laughs> This guy. Just get blocked. Are you gonna die? Can I? How do I? Click on the. Just click on the portal. It's not. It's not letting. What the heck? It's not letting me click on it. I did for me. I really thought you were about to push me back. More are coming. Hurry, or we will all become thralls. Just walk through. It wouldn't let me. It's, it, it, it's, it's taking you, right? Yeah. I think it. Two of y'all are dead, so or one of y'all is. <sighs> they remind me of like the Avatar. Are we gonna stand there and be shocked or are we just gonna... <laughs> Yeah, we're not in combat right now, so. So, uh, short rest. I can give you a potion, Jay. I have one. Stop me here. Oh, wait, you probably no, go while. Oh, well, we should probably go before they murder all the brains. Well, I mm. think I, can you save the game? Come to the skull. Yeah. Save, 
I'm going right beside you. Why are you ungrouped with me? All right. You get every single critical. Oh. There we go. Got a heart. You got anything? All right. All right. You hear the same line, right? It's not over. Come to the skull. Uh, I'm seeing someone called the Emperor, Terrace. Dang, boy's tweaking. What's happening? Who are these people? Get the Yankees? Oh, well, yeah, right. but. We killed your leader, so I don't know who's leader. You're on our side, right? Mind player? We were just fighting them, Chase, so I don't think so. Took my key, bro. Where are the other two? Up there. Oh, this is nice. This one fight. I hate that this game keeps taking my camera to whatever character it's on, and then doesn't move it back once they've uh wow 
flowered. Oh yeah. What happened? Oh. Why is Mentor all the way back here? Yeah, that might be a while before Mentor gets back. It might be a while. <laughs> is she in the? Is she fighting? <laughs> I got her. Yeah, look at the character. I can't. But she's I see her on the, the map. First, she's all the way back at the first fight. Oh my god. It's because you weren't grouped with her, I guess. For some random reason, I wasn't. Um. Come on, Shadowheart. Do your thing. Go. And then... Uh. Dude. <laughs> Destroy the honor guard. Wait. Oh my god. I'm just not noticing that Shadowheart took a lot of damage from that for whatever reason. Just you wait. Just you wait until Shadowheart gets there. Not Shadowheart. Mentor gets there. Just you wait. Dapper in the back. There you go. Dang it. Dang, now I kind of regret. I should have brought Lazel here. We can still go back. <laughs> okay, that mage, this mage has to be up on the way. Yeah. I agree. Oh, they killed one of them. Nice. You kill that one, I, I can go kill this guy. Alright. Minthara helped out a lot that night. Too Don't look at me like that. I am a mind flayer. Yes. Without me, you would be a slave to the absolute. Of all the things to be indebted to, a bloody mind flayer. A bloody mind flayer. I prefer the other version of you. It's like I said before, I'm just like you. Yeah. An adventurer. I came from Baldur's Gate, though I was never one to be constrained by circumstance. I longed for more. That longing until you jumped off a building and killed yourself on a search for treasure. To a colony of mind flayers who caught me, changed me into what I am now. For years, I served the Elder Brain, the one you know as the Absolute. I was a thrall like any other, but I was fortunate. I broke free and started a new life in my old city. I sustained myself on criminals, unglamorous, 
but there are plenty of them, rarely missed. And they fueled me while I did my work. I had the good fortune to meet Duke Stillman. We formed a partnership. Uh, he's kind of lost me a bit. Her, yeah. I became the governing force behind the Knights of the Shield, the largest mercantile operation in Baldur's Gate. People referred to me as the Emperor. Such was my influence. Though, of course, they had no idea what I really was. So they, couldn't see behind her they couldn't see your hands? I was happy for a while. Are you the... Until my true nature was discovered by the tyrant himself, Lord Gortash. He tore me from my home and brought me back to the brain where I became a slave once again. I mean, I guess I did ask for a backstory. The name was intended as a slight to remind me of the heights from which I fell. But I have grown fond of it. It encapsulates well who I've become. Okay. Um... <laughs> I'm, I'm thinking the same thing chase i'm like okay i was like you, i was like okay so you were you were helping now you were a good guy but okay you killed innocent people i don't i don't understand he's like yeah you know I, he was like yeah you know i helped out i also ate people's brains for a living but after that hmm. prince orpheus son of the first leader Githyanki. His power has been the source of your continued protection against the voice of the Absolute. The power to disrupt hive mind communication. It is the same power that enabled Orpheus's mother to bring about the fall of the Elithid Empire eons ago. A power she passed on to him and that I leveraged for you. When Orpheus's mother left, Usurper took her place. Blacketh declared herself queen of the Githyanki. Blacketh wanted his power, but Orpheus rose against her, and so she sealed him and his honor guard within this prison. Bound by infernal chains, Orpheus could never leave. Bound by duty, his guard never would. Did you do the thing? Did you do the thing? Home on that prince. And if they had succeeded, we would be lost. I am relieved. You have embraced your potential enough that you could help me eliminate them. Alone, Orpheus will be much easier to control. A lot of lore dropped on me. Yeah, right? A very good question. One that I have been unable to answer. That Orpheus lives at all is ruinous to Blackith. She has done everything in her power to keep his existence a secret. And that Gortash and the Chosen found out about it. This is impossible to explain. But it was important enough to them that Gortash sent me to retrieve it. The moment I found it, I felt a change. My free will returning. I followed the feeling inside. And found Orpheus. I realized what the prison was for. Containment. While my body was within the prison's bounds, my mind was free. I could resist the Elder Brain, the Chosen. Better yet, I could plan to overthrow them. All I needed to do was subdue Orpheus and find allies in the outer world. You. All right. Dang, I was lying, nothing. Bruh, I would rather just like not say anything. Most certainly Orpheus. He is a threat to her reign. Some Githyanki still revere him in defiance of their teachings. Blacketh was safe as long as they believed him to be dead. But as you can see, he is very much alive. She kept him this way because she was reluctant to eradicate such power. Power that she might one day wish to take from him. If the Githyanki ever find out what she has done, there will be civil war. Blacketh will be finished. 
Bro. Mm. I don't actually care. I don't want to free Orpheus or kill him and take his power. All right, what happens if we free him? terrible idea. The moment he is free, he will attack you. Your only defense would be to kill him. And in so doing, you would doom us both. Yeah, okay. I don't Even want... He is subdued, he feel Orpheus' revulsion. A pulsing hatred that cannot be contained. The Emperor is telling the truth. To him, you are just another wretched illithid. You carry a tadpole. As far as Orpheus is concerned, you are already a lithid. A sworn enemy, just like me. I'm glad you think so. I agree. But there is one thing that you have that I do not. My humanity? My body was destroyed oh, yeah. when I transformed. Yours continues to limit you. I'm not going to turn into a mind player. So. As an illithid, uh -huh. I have far surpassed who I ever was before. You too should embrace this change. I don't like your implied. Or I believe we'll have a better chance of defeating the Elder Brain if you embrace your latent illithid potential. I've been studying you for a while now. I believe I can trigger the next stage of your tadpole's life cycle while continuing to preserve your independence. You have seen what I can do. Imagine yourself with the same strength, the same intelligence, the same devastating beauty. If you let me, I can evolve you. All right. The answer is twofold. One, I can, but it would kill you, as I told you before. Two, why would I? You have done well, the limited form you have, but you would do far better as an illithid. So, do you wish to evolve or not? No. Three. Even as you say the words, you feel a lurch of disappointment. Your mind bristles with illithid potential. How could you be so cruel as to deny yourself what you want most in the world? I felt that. It's your nature. You cannot fight it. So embrace it. Why did I hold out my hand? It wants to evolve, but it cannot do so alone. It must commune with another. Bruh. Yeah. Let's go. Did you know, did you get it? Yep. Okay. A wave of disappointment stronger than any you've ever felt. And then stillness. You've resisted your lithid instincts. For now. You are not ready yet. Keep hold of it then, until you are. It has enough vitality to further your evolution and your allies. Perhaps you will be more inclined to try it when you see more of what our enemy can do. But we mustn't lose focus. We need to resume our journey. You heard the Chosen. The brain has gone to the city and the army marches to follow. We must not let them reach it. We must find the brain and bring it under our control. We'll have to wait. I can't talk right now. All right. So just leave, right? Yeah, I'm gonna loot these bodies though. Oh, I check. Ain't got nothing.
All right, material plane, let's go. <laughs> they just they just died on impact as soon as we exited as soon as we went into that cutscene chat they just had a heart attack i gotta go ask, I, I, I got this on the list oh, what, do you, what do you think of this so there's been a mind flayer inside the artifact or astral that kind of makes sense the though whole time we've had it sounds like utter madness even though i've seen it with my own eyes the more i learn the less i understand just why I was sent to retrieve that thing. But it matters little now. I do not serve Shah anymore. Nor the Mother Superior. The prism is no longer my mission. Saving my parents is. But I digress. Did you want something? Hmm. Or from our village. More likely, it would just put a stop to. I'm like, you're not loaded in or something. I wanted nothing to do with those illicit powers before. You know, can you see you what, know oh, what that offer truly it. entails, don't you? Become half a mind flayer, lose half of yourself. I don't want that. Yeah, I didn't actually want that either. <laughs> All right, that's it. Let's rest. I'll catch a break. You ready to rest, Jess? Yeah, hold on. Wait, what did you say before? Where is everybody else in the village? They're not out there? Nope. Oh well, they're dead. Can I always talk to Mr. Jalen? Yeah. You wish to consult me? So you don't care? Oh, okay. We will need every advantage to survive the battles that are to come. And my illicit parasite has already shown its worth. Yes. If this superior tadpole is capable of unlocking my mind's full potential, it is a tempting proposition. I am surprised you have not drawn on its power yourself. Use it right, like, I'm not using it right now. Alright. Alright, I'm ready, Jay. I'm ready. Okay. Yep. <laughs> Nothing. <laughs> oh. Why? Why has Mentara got her hands like that? She always sleep like that. Yeah, some characters sleep like that. Okay. Oh, now Lazo has a question. She's like, hey, yo. Your parasite communes with Lazelle's. Her heart races as she learns of the events inside the astral prison. Orpheus, Gith's only son. He lives. It is not the Gaith visitor that Vlakith would destroy and Voss would set free. It is Orpheus, the blood of the mother, the prince of the comet. Can you speak English? I don't know what you said. <laughs> Listen close. The Empress spoke oh, only no. in half truths. For you to know. Yeah. 
We've had a mind flare whispering to us in our dreams all this time. <sighs> Why is your hair white? By anything at this stage. Still, it seems keen to be an ally in its own way. Compared to what we're up against, I'm not sure that's a bad thing. All right, I'm gonna leave um, camp. Wait. I checked One our dream. My first day don't help. Don't help boss. Two words and huh? Hold on. Our guardian said don't help boss, which is who she's talking about. Oh, uh, I was not listening to her no. uh, dialogue. But yeah, help, don't help boss. I got you. Are you taking her with you or are you taking Minthara with you? Minthara. Alright. I'm leaving camp. I left you. Oh, I guess you went with me. Leave Act 2. There you go, Charles. <clears throat> this is it, Trace. Act Act Three. We spin. We do everything. Okay. Okay. We must find where Gortash and Orin have established themselves, and take their nether stones. My guardian, no. It's been so long designing her. Why? It's been so long time to create her. close now. My former peers will be watching, no doubt. <gasps> I'm about to enter Baldur's Gate. We should do what we can to find them. What they know. Nearly the there now. See the city. Up on the hill. Um, excuse me. I can't find my mum. What's that got to do with me? your problem kid get lost oh <laughs> your last year? she was um she was sick she had spots on her face and hands oh she went to go get some herbs and she was supposed to come back the same day oh that was last 10 day though it's not talking about her Right. It's talking about her mom. Why are we saying uh, it? The, the that's a person, Chase. Yeah, she. I don't know. She or he. Um. <laughs> um. Yeah. It sounds like his mom's dead. Sounds like their mom's dead. But uh we'll help them, right? We're doing everything, right. Chase. Uh what do you what do you think? Three. Well no. What do you think? One or two? I was thinking one or two. I say one. What is five dollars gonna do in this town? Is anything um, cheap? Thank you so much. I don't have anything and you can't do anything without any coin. I'll pay you back when I find my mom. 
Who's dead? I'm a bit busy at the moment. Oh, Mentara, talk to her. I do not understand why the matrons, sorry, patriarchs of the city do not open their gates to the refugees. I agree, they should offer some shelter from the bank. <laughs> Two. Two. <laughs> uh, say two. I yeah. was not suggesting they be allowed to roam free. They should be put to work. The city needs laborers and fodder to protect it. I am suggesting they be fed and sheltered, and that they work in return. Call it whatever you wish. Perhaps you think it would be better for them to starve or be slaughtered here, while the citizens hide behind their walls. Dang. I don't think you said the right thing, Joyce. All right, let me talk to this little kid again. I'm still looking for my mum, but um, thank you for helping me. You were really nice. Okay. Uh, is that a quest now? Not a quest yet, but I'm sure I'll have to look it up. How to help? What's that kid's name? The place was empty. Yena. Keep those thugs away from my family. Denuvia! Get these squatters out of my house now! <laughs> Arthur, sweetheart, you paid me and my boys to be caravan guards, not cattle wranglers. If you want us to get our hands dirty, it'd be our pleasure. But that'll be extra. I just want to remove these unlawful interlopers from my property. I need a turn. Wow. <laughs> I can't let them stay here. What if the little prank gets into the basement? My basement. Oh, nothing interesting. Just materials. I'm a craftsman, you see. Look, I have some very valuable components in there. I need to get that lot out before they damage something. Who do you think you are? Zenobia? People are lining up to break into my property. Do something about it. You paid us to protect you and your high quality merchandise on the road. <laughs> Zenobia dog. Our destination. As I said, <laughs> anything else is extra. She got that dog in her. <sighs> this is the last time I hire someone from the guild. Fine. Here's the extra. Finish the job. Now, please show this meddler some of that famous Rivington hospitality. Damn, we just got the sound. <laughs> we just got the sound. <laughs> <laughs> we just got the sound of the fight. <laughs> I'm just hearing the... I'm just hearing the ground shake. And I'm just seeing the battle. We just got the sound of the fight. I'm just gonna watch you from back here. I thank you, Jay. No problem. I didn't save, so this this is This is what? This is what's gonna happen. I'll kill you, dog. I'm gonna kill you. You're an enemy? Okay, well, you can die. Like I said, you can die. You have one HP. You do not deserve to be alive right now. Oh. Can you help? You good? <laughs> no, but it's like it could be a lot faster if you just help. 
Oh, there's a lot more, huh? All right, I'm coming. Oh, I just hit her. Dang. We just got to town, Jason. The first thing you want to do is pick a fight. I didn't pick the fight. The fight picked me. Dang, Jay. That's kind of fire. There you go. I thought the whole point of disengage is the fact that you can't attack me and I can't attack you. All that blood over you. Give me that. Give me that. Damn. <laughs> well, with Zenovia and the others gone, I don't suppose you'll take no for an answer. All right, they can stay. Are you happy now? Now I have to figure out what I'm going to do. I'm sure I'm not a room. A room can wait. After what you've put me through, I need a drink. This man's name is Arthur, not Arthur. Arthur. Go to the basement. Go in the house and go to the basement. Way forward. I'm not quite sure why you stood up for us like that, but I won't say I'm not grateful. Thanks. I may Torm keep you. 
You're the first person in this city to have our backs. Thank you. Really. We showed up, Chase. Murdered a few people. Oh, said, you better let them in your house. And then left. This is the first thing we did in the city. Now we don't have to leave. I'm gonna build a big house for all the rats. It's gonna be really fancy. You'll see. It's gonna be really fancy. You'll see. Yeah, you're gonna get bullied in school, dude. I was sure wow. I don't think the I'm sorry, little one. I think this bird is broken up here. Bird? Yeah. Oh, I can unlock it. Uh, if you lock pick it, I think we're gonna get into a battle or something. Save the game. Oh, wait, there are. No. Yeah, save the game. Saving. Well, I don't have a lock pick, but you lock it. Alright. They won't notice. I mean, no, none of them are upstairs, so that's fine. <laughs> I need all the ingredients to unlock the door. We'll have some peace now. See, that's nothing. What peace? Haven't you heard there's an army marching towards the Still 100 gold. Still a letter. I mean, it's fine. Oh, I found the basement key. Alright. I'm not breaking the wire or anything. I found the annals of Baldur's Gate. I found drip. That's what I found. Come to this closet. Wait, Jay. Oh, I'm coming. I found actual drip. It's like in the green one. Oh, wow. You can have the rest. Where even is the basement? I found another broken bird. I don't know. To threaten the children. Wait, did you talk to the girl? Good thing you sorted that out. I was this close to chucking a knife right between that trollop's eyes. Man, it's a nice city. I would live in it. I would live in this city in real life. Would you, Chase? Yeah. I mean, what's wrong with the city? There's an army marching towards it. I found the hat. Oh. Scared stack. Oh. Alright, where are you? Where'd you go? In the hatch, in the hatch. Where? It's literally, look at the map. It says it. Oh. There's trips. I don't want to trip over any of them. I have failed everything. Watch how you go. There's a trap. Can I hit the gong? Just disarm the bomb. 
Shadowheart, you are amazing. I took more damage than she did. <laughs> I doubt a bear this size went down without a fight. I don't want to judge. I don't know how to fix for that, but I don't want it. I just broke physics. This and all this arm. Need a fifteen. That's easy money. Oh, flute. Oh, I'm encumbered. Yeah, Jay had a lock. Can you hear me a lock pick? <laughs> oh, you went back to camp. No. Says, why do you never have a, a lock pick, huh? Because you steal them. No. Yeah. Oh. oh, you could just right click and send it to camp mm -hmm. without actually having to go. Oh, that's so cool. You didn't know that? Are you looking yeah. at my stream right now? I just found out right now on my own. Oh. Oh, wait, Dion, why is this... The Shadow Heart need this armor. What armor? I gave it to Shadow Heart. Oh. <laughs> That's what that meant. What's next? You made her encumbered. Because <laughs> I didn't know what the yellow sign meant to the name. So I was just like, I'll press it. Why not? I didn't <laughs> know. Yeah. Yeah, there is better anyways. It is better armor? Mm, the one she has is better armor. Oh. Oh. I had like a bag in my inventory that had like a bunch of food and snacks. Is there something oh, we're supposed to find? Hiding. I don't know. You assigned it for a reason, so I'm assuming so. What do we have here? Oh, that's a lot of reading. Oh my god. Okay. 
Are you leaving? I'm just checking out more stuff. I'm gonna get a sound of this. Who is that? I'm gonna just keep on this. I don't think he's on this. Uh oh. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, I don't. I'm fine, right? What to do? <laughs> you are not fun. <laughs> That's crazy. And there's more traps? Yeah. It's unfortunate. Uh. I'm gonna go get a snack. I'll be back. God dang it. Just give it to me, game. Just give it to me. Oh my god. A whole dang chest. Can't afford to stay idle. Chase. Still alive. So that's progress. I just don't want to die. I'm gonna let you go first because uh, you have mercy. Okay, you first. Chase, I couldn't get the lock pick on the chest, so I stole. I took the whole chest. <laughs> Shadowheart is still down here, by the way. Yeah, I know. So you just instead of trying to get it, you just took the whole thing. <laughs> 